Hello everybody, this is Poopenhammer, and we are playing Minecraft. Notice that I have a brick structure right here. This will signify the center of the grand structure that I plan on building. Um, and at the center, we will be putting a mob grinder. It's going to be a simple um, fall trap. Um, and I need to start counting. Two, three. Uh, three times twenty-four is seventy-two. So eight into that stack. I'm picking glass because I want to see them falling through their doom. Now, eventually, when 1.5 comes out, we'll have hoppers. And this will become much more efficient because every bit of drop will be put into a chest. For now, we'll just have a uh, water stream going to an area. Uh, I didn't want to do that. Um, I'm too high. There's five, so 52. Okay, I think that's it. 20 something. Alright, so I have a pretty effective uh, mob trap. Um, I believe Etho used or showed the trick first. I am correct. Um, but the thing I like most about it is that it's a cylinder, um, which is what I'm going to be. It's going to be kind of the uh, the center spoke of a wheel. Um, so it is like this. The hardest floor is the first floor because you don't have any pattern to go off of. Um, yeah, so this goes like this. Uh, one, two, three. And this side. It's like this. This also has three pads. Like this. Now it's going to create what is nine times um, eight. Is it eight? Four, eight. A lot of a lot of spawning pads. I think it's about eighty. Round eighty. So how many is it? It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve spawning pads at nine apiece. <coughs> well, it's eight times twelve, so it's ninety-six per floor, which is a pretty decent spawning area. Um. Especially for how high I plan on going. Um, I plan on having a pretty large tower in the center um, with floating islands uh, going around everything. <coughs> Sorry about that. I almost spilled over my drink. So that's like this. This is going to be a wall. Like I said, the first floor is kind of a little tough to put down. With a, uh, a ceiling, though, already in place, it's a lot easier to put one in. And I gotta get down somehow. <laughs> uh, 
I forgot to bring a water bucket. So we might be falling to our deaths or hitting that water perfectly. On our way back up, we'll be <laughs> putting ladders down, which I built, that I uh, brought, I mean. Um, let's put some light up here. And to make sure that spiders don't spawn on here, I'm going to put a half slab right in the middle of each of these pads so that they cannot spawn. So this, this, i got to put these two center ones in. Okay, this is two and three. All right, got this. It's four this way. Need to make this one now. That one. Is that the basic form? Okay, that's the basic form. Now, I'm going to build these pads up. Do want to go around the edge though. This will be like that. It's very important. Here, I'm going to be putting water in all the corners. I think there's something like uh, it's one, two, three, four. There's eight water source blocks in this. One, two, three. So this needs to come out. This needs to come out. Good view of the uh, farm right there. Now, I'm, my plan is also that I'm going to um, build storage, kind of a little mini warehouse underneath this, so it's not just empty, unused air. Um, but ultimate goal is to finally get, not finally, um, well, kind of, to, to finally build a house <laughs> for me to uh, live in. Um, do, 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 do. It's a video finishing right there. How high am I? Three, 
Um, okay, so this, that's the proper height of the wall. Okay, and what else? This is the last one, I think. That and like this. Now you can see this is very uh, block resource intensive. Um, it's very, very good cause though. We can get all of the drops from enemies from them from this uh, grinder, which means we can get infinite amounts of TNT. You can get infinite amounts of arrows and stupid zombies flesh, but it's unavoidable. Um, we might turn it into a um, an EXP farm at one point, but I don't really think we need to. Close that. This open. Um, like that. Let's put that up there. Perfect. Yeah, I had had almost in a complete inventory of stone when I came up here. So you can see how much blocks I've gone through. Or how many blocks I've gone through. If you want to use proper English. Uh, like that. I'm leaving the, these corner blocks like that because it's going to... When I put the source blocks in, it's going to uh, be a little hectic trying to uh, get out of the water stream to not fall down at first. Oh, I looked at an enderman. This might be our trip home. <laughs> Where he went, though. Oh, he's down there. Can I come up here? Oh. oh, not good. There I go. <laughs> well, that's one way to go fall down. Um, let me grab my stuff. <laughs> no one expects the Enderman. My stuff went everywhere. Glass, arrows, my shovels over there. Let's put them back on. One, two, three, four. Put those on. All right. Let's get some water. I need to get two buckets. Now that I think about it. Not the buckets. And that is the dryer going on, if you can hear that. Enderman disappeared. All right, I think, or is it, so it's one, two, three, space, one, two, three, water, wall. Whoa. <laughs> Saw you at the right time. 
Okay. Get that. Okay. Now, where were we? This. Um, I know we didn't get source. Uh, oh, oh, Jesus! Not good. Not good. Not good. Oof! <laughs> I was about to say what I didn't get was half slabs. I'll have a bunch. Fourteen. Um, let's make some more. That's going to give me three stacks of them. Um, so I'll just put them of that back. Uh, da, 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 da. That, okay. I have terrible at math, apparently. Um, two, three, four. Glass away. Um, I don't need the redstone either. So let's put that away too. Uh, everything else I kind of need. Okay. Let's head on back. I plan on making this kind of like a imposing structure. So it will be... have four of these uh, legs. It won't be a ladder, it'll be a staircase on the inside, going up. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to building this. Put the water in here. Skip it along. <laughs> comes uh, here. There's eight spots that they can spawn on each of these. Plus, I added four more on each. So what is it? Eight times eight. Eight times eight times twelve is. 96 plus 4 is 100. So there's 100 spawning spots on each of these layers. I have I plan on having at least like 7 of these. So there's probably going to be 700 spawning spots in this it's going to be completely dark in this area. So it will be glorious. Um do that. Now, since I'm kind of done with the area, I will close that off, everything's set up, and away we go. There's the dryer again. <laughs> about that. Loud as heck. Close that in. Lots and lots of blocks.
All right. This is the height of everything. <coughs> it's only going to be too high, so no Enderman can spawn in this. Um, yeah, then we just fill in the ceiling. Create the dark room. So many. Probably swap these. Let's see if this is enough. Probably gonna have to go uh, branch mining and get more cobble for this. This uses up a lot of materials. You have too much cobble until you don't have enough. <laughs> but if I've learned one thing over the couple of years that I've played this is you never have enough materials to do anything. <laughs> You're always a couple short when you think you have enough. just torch this area a little bit because we're going to have to come back here and uh, add a couple more layers but that is one layer of the my mob grinder or level 100 it's going to be up above the clouds by the time I'm done um, so yeah that is the mob grinder and yeah I think I'll end the episode right here. I think I'm gonna do some branch mining. I'll be make a couple more layers of this. Use up the rest of my cobble. Um, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.